Well, this weekend will be a celebration for Minnesotans of several different faiths. Passover, Ramadan, and Easter all overlap this year. That only happens once every few decades. Meals are a major part of recognizing these holidays. This year, families are spending more than usual to make that happen. Our Adam Duxter found out how some are handling the price hikes and which items might have the biggest impact on your wallet, huh, Adam? Yeah, for many of us, the holidays are spent around the table, meaning it's not just Christmas this year that involves making a list and checking it twice. At Midtown Global Market, the Easter celebration is in full swing. I think as we've had young kids, Easter has become more special for our family. But for Amber Cameron and her family of four, we normally have ham and scalped potatoes. Those favorite foods are coming at a cost. Yeah, I noticed that a lot this year and it felt like just my cart was very expensive compared to previous years. The USDA's food price outlook shows your Easter meal will cost you 5% more this year than it did last year. Meaning if you usually spent $250 on things like chicken, um, roast beef, ham, macaroni and cheese, greens. This year, that'll be closer to $275. It's definitely a lot more expensive for sure. Candy Phillips has seen it firsthand. Like $150 really don't get you anything. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, it's, I mean, groceries is expensive. And some things have jumped higher than others. I think um, ham for sure. Up 7% for the USDA. Phillips says ultimately it doesn't mean the feast is canceled, but it certainly does mean she's more cautious in planning. We decide who's going to bring what, and then that's how we do that. If we're shopping for Easter, it's you plan, you know, it's like I know Easter is coming or I know the holiday is coming, so I'm going to plan to, you know, make sure I'm able to get those things, maybe start getting some things early. Both women I spoke to today say they did just that, plan their meals in advance to limit their bills. They also did make sure to say the holidays, no matter what you celebrate, are all about family, which of course will always be free. Very good perspective, Adam. Yes, thank you.